Hello everyone and welcome back to Tech Horizon. My name is Dave and today I'm going to show you how you can control your Windows 10 PC or laptop with your smartphone. This is a great party trick to impress your friends and it can even be useful. Say that your PC is in the basement or you even left the house and you forgot to turn it off. Well, just use your phone to access the desktop and shut it down. It's as simple as that. A further benefit that you'll have from using this method is that your smartphone can literally have the power of your PC. This allows you to sit on your sofa and use your mobile while benefiting from your PC software as well as the power. But before we get started, if you're not subscribed to my channel yet and you enjoy the straight to the point tech related content and tutorials that I create, you're welcome to subscribe. And if you found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like. And now, let's get started. First of all, you're going to want to download the required software for your PC or laptop. So go ahead and click on the link in the description below and it will redirect you to the real VNC website. Make sure to download the real VNC server instead of the viewer since you want to access your PC with your phone and not the other way around. Go ahead and download it for whatever version you need, Windows, Mac OS, Linux, Raspberry Pi. Just go ahead and click download. Once it's finished downloading, click on the file and go through the installation process. As soon as you're done installing it, it'll require you to sign in. So go ahead and do that. I already signed in, but if you don't already have an account, just click on the link in the description to create your free account. Now that your VNC server is set up, you're going to need to download the viewer on your smartphone or tablet and connect them with each other. So I'm going to quickly switch to my phone. Once you're on your phone, just click on another link in the description to download the corresponding viewer app from the Play Store. Or just open your Play Store and search for Real VNC Viewer and download it. When opening it up, you'll have to sign in with the same account used earlier. Then you need to confirm your email address. Then click on the menu icon and on the team category. You should see your PC's name popping up. Just click on it and a connection will be established. Now you will have to authenticate once more, so type in your PC password instead of your real VNC credentials. And press continue. Once you've done that, you should have full remote access to your computer's desktop and you can do everything your heart desires. Just kidding, you can do whatever you would usually do on your PC, like using certain programs or turning it off, just remotely on your smartphone or tablet. You can also use this as a great party trick. But apart from this, that would be it for today. I hope you enjoyed the video and I could help you out. If you're interested in seeing how to enable and use VNC on your Raspberry Pi 2, go check out my previous video. And if you found this video helpful, it would definitely make my day if you would leave a like. And if you're not subscribed to my channel yet and you enjoy the straight to the point tech related content and tutorials that I create, you're welcome to subscribe. See you in the next one.